And right now, families are having a hard time finding baby formula. We've had multiple reports of empty shelves, specifically for brands that were pulled over the massive recall back in February. Well, multiple babies got a rare and serious bacterial infection after eating formula from Abbott Nutrition's plant in Michigan. Two babies died. Well, Friday, new information showed a whistleblower complained to the FDA about safety concerns at that plant in October, four months before the formula recall. They laid out issues with poor cleaning practices, falsified records, and instances where employees knowingly put out formula that may have been contaminated. Many of the brands pulled are specifically formulas for those with certain health issues. One family in Oklahoma says they're running out of time to find an alternative. If we can't get that formula, the next option is having to give him a central line and getting all of his nutrition through a central line through, his, uh, through an IV. The Klaus's son, Willie, has GI issues and could get food poisoning like symptoms with the wrong type of formula. Well, the FDA says parents like the Klauses who need this specific formula should discuss the risks with their doctors. In a statement Friday, Abbott said that parents seeking their product should contact them directly to request it. They also say they'll work with healthcare professionals to release safe options at no cost to patients.